Mont Springs, Florida, and I go in, I'm in the seventh grade at Moe Middle School. Yeah. Our next two pieces are by Rollo Dilworth and are also spirituals. Our first piece is Jordan's Angels. It tells a story of a child who receives comfort from a vision of being surrounded by a band of angels. There are similar water images found in other spirituals, such as Deep River and Wade in the Water. The Jordan River symbolically represents safety, peace, and freedom. It is believed that slaves often made reference to water when they sang of a planned escape where they would be crossing a river or creek as a means of covering up a trail. The following piece, Prince of Peace, invites us to learn from and follow in the prince or paths of peacemakers who have gone before us. By the way, I'm Mariel Nardi and I attend Teak Middle School and I'm in the eighth grade.
choir members moving around. In a choir like this, I never know what kind of voices I'm going to get. So every year, that's a challenge for me. Do I do SATB? Do I S do SAB? SAT? Do I just do unison or two parts? And the choir mixture that we have up here right now, I definitely have baritone voices. I have one voice that is in the process of changing, so that's considered a cambiata voice. And then I have one male voice that's still a wonderful soprano voice. Then I have all these lovely ladies behind me who are basically sopranos. So what we have done while you see them move is so that they can learn how to sing harmony. So throughout the, the concert tonight, each one of these gals will have taken a turn, at least one turn, in singing harmony so that as they grow up and their voices begin to change and continue to change, they will know how to listen for and sing the harmony. Here's Prince of Peace. Prince as in prince in the sand. <laughs> 